Hey guys, B-Man here. How are you guys doing today? Today, we've got an awesome one for you guys. I have the final tutorial on the Tombstone Glitch. It's fully mastered and I've got all the information you need to know to get out there and be mastering it yourself, guys. You'll be having unlimited money like you see here every game and it won't matter what you do. You can have heat max money every game all sorts of stuff, the plans, you can duplicate items and everything, guys. It's absolutely broken, it's absolutely awesome, and with that said, get down there, smash that like button for me, as that helps me help you guys, and helps the channel grow. Now, guys, as you'll see here, look at my stash. It has two empty slots, okay? Now, that is the key to duplicating money, okay? When you're duplicating money, it goes into the empty slots, and as you'll see here, when I die, I don't fill those slots up with items, and then they remain empty, and then I keep getting money in those slots. So if I come back, those two slots that were empty before have money slots. Each one of those slots is my money folded over. So two slots is double my money, guys, okay? So that is how you're duplicating money, is if you cannot duplicate money, it's because your tombstone is full of items and doesn't have any empty slots. Now, guys, as you see right here, we, I have brought in Tombstone, and I want to add this into my stash so I have unlimited Tombstone every game, right? Now, I want to put this into the last slot of my thing because that's an empty slot for my Tombstone. There's nothing in that slot yet. So to do that, guys, what I need to do is I need to make sure that I don't touch any of the other slots that I've got the stuff in, otherwise I'll lose something from it and create a money slot because it would get rid of it if I put something else in that slot. What I need to do is I need to go and get a large backpack because I want to put it in my final slot. So guys, large backpacks you can buy from the tier to the tier 3 red zone buy stations and just bring a uh, decoy grenade. It's real simple to get there because they've nerfed the zombie spawns and tier 3 is, well, zombie less as you see here. It's no challenge at all. Easily go to the tier 3 buy station and buy a backpack, a large backpack. Now you will see here, guys, what I do to secure Tombstone into this for it is I set up everything else exactly as it was so it does not wipe any of those items and I put Tombstone in in that last slot, okay? And then I die with Tombstone in that slot, guys. Now, because that slot didn't already have an item in it, I didn't have to wipe it first, so the Tombstone will just stick in there permanently. Now, if I'll go over later how to turn one item into many, like you see us with these um, plans here in a minute, guys. So don't stress on that. But as you see here, we died with the Tombstone perk in their backpack, and now that we come back, we have tombstone perk there we also got our money it just got added on as an extra thing so we've actually got more slots right here in our stash than what you see in a large backpack guys that very last slot was actually our money so with that that is all that we've got we now got all of this right up guys now at this point we can go along we can select out what we want to duplicate ourselves and we can go on exfil guys now you don't have to have tombstone equipped i've got it just because i accidentally equipped it you don't need tombstone equipped for this step grab your stuff out of your tombstone whatever's in your tombstone stays in your tombstone for next game grab the stuff you want to exfil and jump onto the exfil chopper you do not need to go down all that you need to do is you do need to close app when you see the successful exfil screen so as you see here it gets the screen successful exfil you close app and you load it back up guys what that does is make it so that your tombstone is still there next game it is not disappeared guys now if for some reason your tombstone disappears don't stress just go buy tombstone and die with nothing in your inventory just and and die with nothing in your inventory when your tombstone comes back you need to at least have one item though so you'll have to sacrifice one item in your stash because when you die with that it will replace what was in there guys okay now what you see i just done here is if you guys exfil doing the close app exfil you can go way past your stash limit and there is no limit for your stash guys now as you see here we just exfilled with all that stuff we come back and all our stuff is back here guys so we just come back and it's duplicated right we can just go along and we can exfil again or you can do what we had done in my stream last night i can bring now bring people in we can drop all the items for the other player and then all we need to do is we, can, we don't even have to get Tombstone or anything from here. We can drop everything. We can drop all of our money and everything that's in our Tombstone will be there next game. We drop it all for our buddy like you see here. Then we can just close out, load back in with another player, 
and we can do the, it all over again, guys. Simple as, easy as, we're going to have the stuff there every single game. So you can either grab it out for yourself and exfil with it, close that while you're exfil, and come back to it still being there and get all the stuff for yourself, or you can do what you see here, you can drop it for other players, you can close app, you can come back in, and then you will have it all. So it's up to you on how you do this or anything, guys. Now, guys, how... I turn this ray gun, I've got one ray gun schematic. We're gonna teach you how to take one and turn it into multiple. So as you see here, take note of what slot the ray gun schematic is in, okay guys? Because this is important for this, okay? Is the slot that it's in. Now, I'm gonna pull it out and it's in that slot. I've already died with it in that slot twice, so it's secured in that slot. I'm gonna die with it in a different slot. So take note of the slots that I had open there. I've put the ray gun plans into a different slot. I come back and it's duplicated, right? But that second slot that we just put it into is not secure yet. I need to die with that ray gun plans in that exact same slot again. Otherwise, I will lose it from that slot. So that's what I do. We go in and we go down a second time with it in the same slot. Now, if you don't do it a second time, all you do is open that slot up to become money. But as we said, we've done it the second time. That slot is now not money. It's going to remain ray gun plants. Now we can take that and we can actually store them into a different slot and duplicate it again. So we've gone down with the ray gun plans and a different slot. This whole time, we're not putting it going down with anything in the slots from where they were. We now have three ray gun plans, guys. We've just duplicated it up again. Now we can go down and we can go down with them in a different slot again. But we've also got the one in the slot that we just got before to secure that one, okay? After you've got it in there, you have to go down a second time with it in it. And now we have five ray gun plans, guys. You can get out there and you can just duplicate it up and then you can share it with whatever it wants. It doesn't have to be the plans. It could be a crystal, it could be an ether tool. That could be anything, guys. But as you see, that's how you do it, guys. And again, if you have one empty slot, that's how you're going to duplicate your money, guys. So it's simple. It's easy. And, well, now, guys, get out there. Get all your get all your stuff duplicated up. Help everyone out. Have fun and have access to everything, guys. With that said, guys, I appreciate you a lot. Thank you guys for watching my videos. Get down there. Smash that like button for me as that helps me help you guys and obviously helps the channel grow. With that said, guys, leave me an awesome comment. Subscribe if you're not already. Make sure your notifications are turned on and make sure you guys have an awesome day. B-Man.